and I am back. I am the one and only Scooty here, back with my Walking Dead playthrough, or let's play, or, or whatever you want to call it. Okay, okay. Let's have a talk to Ken. Now, Okay. 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 She seems to be alright. Everyone out there seems alright. Uh, everyone, yeah. everyone seems okay. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. And there was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to See, get me. Clementine doesn't like the sick but you guy. stopped it. <laughs> yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. The dangerous <laughs> uh, Clementine says the cutest the answers. Not in a little while. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Okay. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. A protector, at least. The store leads to the back. Look into alley. Okay. First aid kit. Oh, that's this. Oh, he's in it. <laughs> uh. Find anything? Find anything? Find anything? It's a photo of the Just a fan. <laughs> Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. Oh, You're a professor no. at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were or that you were tied to this place? Did you tell anyone out there who you were or that you were tied to this place? What's it to you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy. And the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of. Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Okay, um, I think I should be more discreet about because you've got Clementine right in, like, you know, s <laughs> here in, uh, here in distance. And it's like, maybe you shouldn't want to say that in The Guardian now because Clementine could be like, okay, he's a murderer, oh no, but I don't think she will, but it's sort of like that, that could have made problems in itself. But oh well. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Anyway, I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Okay. It's old cane. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Then why don't we keep the cane? My dad gave it to me. See, dad's are smart like that. My dad gave it to me. I don't understand why they blocked this store because when we went in it to look for nitroglycerin there was nothing in it so it, I think it's like you know a bit of a waste of time blocking it or maybe they thought they could get over in through the barricades but I don't know well, loads Better get this anyway, let's just move this can I help? Can I help? sure 
Oh, I should look so happy to help. <laughs> It's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Well, Clementine's a good chick. She's not actually moaning. Cause I'm actually kid enough. This situation no. being, you know, you have a family? crying. It's not in all over the place, and she's took it well. Maybe it's not a good thing, but you know, she's took it well. Let's not talk about that, do we? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing and uh, things like that. I like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. Social studies? You didn't answer my question. <laughs> uh. All right, a little further. Clementine's probably picked up that he's trying to avoid the situation, but Why don't you want to talk about still kids, so you can't expect like her to figure that you? out. Okay, maybe they I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. Why? Why? But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. 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 I'm not a bad guy, okay? I'm not. Things happen, and I'm not a bad guy. we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Really. Okay. I hurt my finger. Oh, that's quite a deep cut, actually. A little. I'll find you a bandage. Aren't zombies like can smell blood or something? Or is that is that a different series or something? The remote for that thing in here someplace. Oh, maybe it's a different series. Oh, well. let's go and see. That's a first stage. A band-aid. Okay, let's gonna let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. I don't think I've ever had to cut that deep cut before. Maybe when I shave. But I don't think it was even that let's deep. Get this cut covered let's up. put the Yes please. Yes please. Yes please. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Okay, I can look in this drawer, that's some nice. Ah, uh, TV remote. Awesome, it's awesome, the awesome. To my dad's TV. That's what I figured. No reception at all. So TV stations are out. That's what I figured. I don't know why I did that again. I see if there's anything else in this. Uh, we can Luckily, use. there's nothing I need in here. Because that's I think we should have took that with us. So we, someone should be ransacking this place. You know, again, bags and stuff and plonking them in. Anything like that would be very useful. Anyway, let's open Smart. this. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. To be honest, I don't want to help Larry because he's if he's the dick. He wanted to kill a kid that he had no obvious proof that he was bitten. He just saw, you know, muck on him. He's like, oh, he's been must be bitten because he's muck on him. Like, oh, bloody dick. Wanna head oh, well. back into the drugstore with me? <sighs> okay. Lee. Okay. Yeah. You're not bad, right? 
I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? <sighs> no, he wasn't. No. Oh, was he bad? He was. Anyway, this I think the first episode is just more of an introduction of the first cast set of characters. Um, apart from that, I don't think there's much to it. Let's see, what else can we do? I think you have to go outside then. I don't know, there's nowhere else to really go. Let's see if Glenn's called in, if not. Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay, same. You're my guy? Oh, no. You're my guy. You know. We're going to try to no. take care of each other. Yes, deal. Let me know if you need anything. Yes. Okay, deal. Hey there, uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Oh. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever. This is Luke. What's up? <laughs> so I'm down at that motor in and well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor in. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do. What happened so to the hammer he got yeah. from Clementine? Good. Like when he sound too bad they first met. Let me know you would have thought he would have kept out. that hammer. I could use a job. But he doesn't. That no was. No, I'll stop this part here just so it's more for the next part because I don't want to carry this episode too long. So anyway, I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoyed this part and if you enjoyed, like and if you want to sub, subscribe if you want to. I won't force you. Anyway, anyway, I'm signing off and bye for now.